Coming up next on Auto Show TV, little minivan action today. We'll compare the Dodge Grand Caravan and the Chrysler Town & Country at Elmwood Auto Group. Plus, we'll get a look inside Colonial Toyota in Smithfield to learn all the ways they serve their customers. Also, we'll check out Honda's new SUV crossover, the HRV at Sakuchi. And changing your oil with Jim Melvin and this week's Best Buys. All that and more next on Auto Show TV. I know. I skipped one again. <laughs> I skipped one again. All right. I got it. I'm ready. <laughs> it's Auto Show TV. Good morning. Welcome to Auto Show TV this morning. I'm John Coletto. We're coming to you today from Colonial Toyota in Smithfield. Well, as you can imagine, it takes an awful lot to create a successful car dealership. You need great people, you certainly need great systems in place for it all to work together, and most of all, you need terrific cars, trucks, and SUVs. They certainly have that here at Colonial Toyota, and in a few minutes, we're gonna learn just what makes them so successful. But first, we're gonna take a look at a couple of the terrific minivans at Elmwood Auto Group. Today we're talking minivans and we're here at Elmwood Auto Group with Dennis Freeman. Dennis, you have two of the best. Why don't we get right to it? We sure do. We actually have two of the best selling minivans in the industry. We have the Chrysler Town & Country and we have the Dodge Grand Caravan. And a lot of people ask, why does Chrysler have two minivans? The main reason is, is about preference. Some people prefer Chrysler and some people prefer Dodge. The Town & Country is designed to be the more luxurious of the two vans, and the Grand Caravan is designed to be the sportier of the two. Now, the Town & Country comes standard with leather seats, heated seats, and single-disc DVD, as well as power sliding doors and power liftgate. Those items are all optional on the Grand Caravan. Now, both vans are powered by Chrysler's flagship engine, the Pentastar V6, paired with an eight-speed automatic transmission to maximize fuel economy. Both vans come standard with seven passenger seating as well as full stow-and-go. Let's take a closer look inside. All, right. All town and countries come standard with power sliding doors and power lift gate. These power sliding doors can be activated with a simple pull of the handle as you just saw from a button right on the inside of the door for the interior passengers. You can also open and close the sliding doors from overhead from the front passenger position or from the key fob. And with a simple touch of a button, you can open and close all the doors and the lift gates. Now, the Town & Country has one of the most sensitive obstacle detection systems in its class. Simply press the button, the door will close. If there happens to be an object in the way, as soon as it senses that object, it will retract. Now, these second row seats fold very easily. Simply flip up the cargo area cover, pull the lever, flips and folds, and it's stowed. Ta-da! You could do that with a baby on your head. You, you really could. <laughs> it, it, it only requires one hand. It's, it's done very easily. And to put back in place, simply grab the lever on the back of the seat, push back into place, and once again, you're back in business. Now, the engineers at Chrysler thought of everything when designing our minivans, but they really concentrated on functionality and storage. Now these rear seats fold flat into the floor as easy as one, two, three, four. Now if we simply skip number two and pull strap one and three, these seats actually flip backwards for tailgating. It's nice at ball games, concerts, watching fireworks. And this is a 60-40 split folding seat. So you can fold down one side or both sides. That's amazing. It is amazing. Pretty awesome actually. <laughs> so we've already pulled lever number one. Simply pull lever number two. Pull three again, pull number four, and this seat folds flat into the floor. Ta-da! It's a With, lot of space. There is a lot of space. One again, down. 143 cubic feet of storage. You can actually get an eight-foot piece of plywood in the back here with all the seats folded down. Now, the first thing you're going to notice, Victoria, is a lot of soft, supple materials, a lot of soft touch points, as well as wood grain. The town and country is designed to be the more luxurious of the two vehicles. Now on your left hand side of the door is all your power window, door lock and mirror controls. There's also a lockout feature that if any little ones in the back were trying to play with the power windows, you could simply lock them out and they would no longer have access to the power windows. 
Your electronic vehicle information center is located in the middle of the instrument cluster and it tells you things such as fuel economy, how far you can travel and the amount of gas that you have left, what your average miles per gallon has been. It will also tell you the exterior temperature outside. It will tell you the direction you're traveling in. A lot of useful information. Panning to the right here we have our five and a half inch navigation screen and this is in full color and it also has a backup camera. Now this system like all crisis systems has a 40 gigabyte hard drive built in. You can also load the DVDs for the rear DVD player here as well. Now is this also available on the caravan? This radio is available in the caravan. The caravan comes standard with a single disc radio player. Now the town and country comes standard with this five and a half inch screen. A lot of these features that you're seeing on the town and country are optional on the caravan. There's no shortage of storage in the town and country like I've said before. And again, the town and country comes with a total of 11 cup holders. Four of them are located right in the center area. You have this tray that slides out for cup holders and change holders and this full length center floor console that's also slidable. Now we have four cup holders here but you can actually slide this console to the back and you can even go a little bit further and slide it all the way to the center. The town and country and the caravan are loaded with safety features, some of which protect you during a crash and some of which help you avoid a crash. The town and country does come available with forward collision warning and adaptive cruise control. Like I said before, there's a total of 11 airbags, three up front, one that deploys from the driver's side uh, steering wheel, one that deploys from the passenger side, and there's actually an inflatable knee blocker that deploys from underneath the steering wheel. The full length overhead console is standard on the town and country and optional on the Grand Caravan. This, all, this is also where the single disc DVD player is located and if it has the optional second row DVD that would be located in the back as well. You see ambient lighting overhead. It's either a blue light or a green light depending on your choice. Well, Dennis, there's a lot to like with both of the minivans. I guess the biggest question is now, which one do we choose to buy? It's a tough decision, but we do have a vast selection of the best-selling minivan in the country. We have Motor Trends Truck of the Year. We have a powerful lineup of SUVs. So I'd like to invite all of our customers to come down for our Drive and Discover event and get a great deal. Auto Show TV's Car Care Tips, presented by Melvin's Tire Pros, where buying tires and fixing your car is never a hassle. We're here at Melvin's Tire Pros on Post Road in Warwick with Jim Melvin, our car care expert today. Oil 101, so a little education here. Let's start with just the, the three basic types of oil that most people use. John, the first one is basically your conventional oil. This is the oil that's been around since the beginning of time that right. we use in most vehicles today. The second choice is the synthetic blend oil change, which is basically your conventional oil added to some of the characteristics of the synthetic blend. The most common newer type of oil is the full synthetic oil. Now, when the full synthetic oil came around, there was an awful lot of confusion. Really, the shtick, so to say, with synthetic oil is all of the damage that's done to your car with oil issues is basically right at startup. Synthetic oil lubricates about 15 times faster than conventional oil. Therefore, at initial startup, it lubricates faster, hence no, no damage to the engine. So is that what you would recommend? Yes, most of these cars today, not only does the synthetic oil last dramatically longer, but as far as protection for your engine, it is far superior to, to uh, conventional oil. Yeah. Now speaking of how long the oil lasts, now in a lot of cars you've got the oil life percentage, percentage of li life. Uh, is that indicator accurate? Is that what we should really, uh, really trust? Yes, it is accurate, but one of the things that people have to realize is that is only as accurate as the consumer that sets it to the uh, computer in the car. What you will do is you will reset a... Or you will. The, the technician right? will reset the oil light, but what happens is, you know, in the old days, oil would basically recommend to be replaced on 3,000 mile intervals. With a lot of these synthetic blends and full synthetics, some recommend 5,000, some 7,500. So really the, the moral of the story is, look at the owner manu uh, manual in your car, see what the recommendation on oil life is, and stick to it. All right, if you need an oil change, come to the experts here at Tire Pros. Melvin's Tire Pros, where buying tires and having your oil changed is never a hassle. 
the official auto loan provider of Auto Show TV is Navigant Credit Union for all your new, used, and classic car and truck financing needs. You love everything about your new ride. It smells so good. But maybe you could be paying a little less for it. It's not too late, you know. Let Navigant Credit Union take a look at your rate. We could help you refinance and maybe save you a little every month. What could you do with the extra money? Hmm. Road trip, maybe? Navigant Credit Union. Enjoy life's journey. Shopping for a used car just got easier, thanks to Auto Intelligence. Here are just some of the five-star recommended pre-owned dealerships in the Rhode Island area, evaluated by Auto Intelligence. See the entire list at autointelligence.org. These are dealerships which have passed our 15-point test of reputable business practices and customer satisfaction. It's a little extra peace of mind. Begin your search at autointelligence.org and find a great pre-owned car from a recommended dealer in Rhode Island and Southeastern Mass. autointelligence.org. My name is Brian Benoit from Anchor Subaru. Anchor Subaru loves pets. To show how much, we're having our first pet day here at Anchor. Join us and the Rhode Island SPCA on July 11th for refreshments, raffles, giveaways, and a very special on-site pet adoption, offering a chance for these wonderful pets to find their forever homes. Also, bring your dog or cat by for a chance to star in our next TV commercial. Cooper and I, along with the entire Anchor family, look forward to seeing you here on July 11th. If you'd like more information about any of the dealers and deals you've seen on today's show or would like to view previous episodes of Auto Show TV, go to our website, theautoshow.tv. Rhode Island's best kept secret has been revealed. It's the new Colonial Toyota in Smithfield. Minutes from Providence and right off routes 295 and 146 in Smithfield and just up the street from Lincoln Mall. Folks come from all over to Colonial Toyota for the selection, expertise, and pricing. Plus, Colonial Toyota's world-class service is second to none. We have 20 bays in our shop here at Colonial Toyota, 18 full-time service technicians, including techs who have achieved the highest level of certifications from Toyota, Toyota Master Diagnostic Technicians, and we have four hybrid technicians who have achieved the highest level of certification with Toyota as well. When customers arrive here at Colonial Toyota, they're able to pull right inside our building, which is really nice when there's bad weather. We meet them right at the car and review all of their service needs. If you'd like, we'd be happy to bring you into the shop to see your vehicle and explain what we're recommending and why that work needs to be done. We have over $10 million of parts available to us within 24 hours, and we also have the Toyota Tire Center. You can visit us at ColonialToyota.com to schedule your service appointment with us online 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, and you can view our service specials page for savings coupons we have available. If you'd like to leave your vehicle with us, we have shuttle service. We'll drive you to work or back home if you'd like. We also have rental cars available. But if you choose to wait here at Colonial, we have a convenient, comfortable waiting area right next to our sales showroom. I think the thing I'm most proud of here at Colonial Toyota is our commitment to exceed your expectations. The vehicle exchange program here at Colonial Toyota consists of us monitoring your current vehicle, which means if you're going to go over your mileage on your lease, we'll let you know. If you can trade in your vehicle and keep your payments the same with no money down, we can also let you know that when the best time is to trade your vehicle in. We make it as simple as you just walking over to our sales department while you're here for service. Uh, we have a staff here in our vehicle exchange department to help you and assist you with any vehicle exchange questions that you might have. Uh, they're also at your service by phone, via email, or just walking over to the sales department. So here's an example of the program that we utilize for the vehicle exchange program here at Colonial Toyota. Uh, in this particular case, this gentleman can actually lower his current monthly payment on his Avalon lease before he goes over his mileage, because it does show here that he will go over his mileage about $500 at the end of his lease, but he can trade out of it right now before he actually gets those mileage penalties on his current Avalon, get into the new Avalon with no money down and actually lowers payment about $22 a month. With today's busy world, uh, we actually handle our internet sales clients with fast, easy, and convenient service. We can help you select the vehicle that you're looking for online, as well as prepare your financing. Therefore, when you come into the dealership, it'll be a nice, easy, simple, convenient, and short time. Here at Colonial Toyota, our job is to exceed our customers' expectations by being upfront and honest. We want this to be an easy process buying a car from us. 
Our upfront sales specialists are trained on a daily basis to provide our customers the information they are looking for. Customers get the information they ask for, whether it's product information, price information, or both. It's that easy. Also, we deal with all credit situations. If your credit has been down the bumpy road, come visit us at our Credit Collision Center at Colonial Toyota. We finance all. Well, there you have it. We have some great things going on here at the new Colonial Toyota. A world-class service department, over 20 bays to service everyone in the greater Providence area. We have a complimentary shuttle service. We have rental cars available. We have a new and used car inventory with over 350 vehicles, great selection. We have one of the fastest growing sales department in all of New England. So give us a try for the best car buying experience of your life. And look us up on the web at colonialtoyota.com. The new Colonial Toyota in Smithfield. Rhode Island's best kept secret has been revealed. Now it's Auto Show TV's Best Buys. We search for the best cars in the market and tell you where to find the deals. Let's start with some SUV crossovers. First, a terrific lease deal on a 2015 Toyota RAV. Colonial Toyota in Smithfield has a RAV4 XLE for $249 a month, and that is with zero down. This XLE is automatic, backup camera, Bluetooth, lots of the good stuff, and of course it's a RAV4. $249 a month lease at Colonial Toyota in Smithfield. Cerrone's in South Attleboro, right on Route 1, has a nice lease deal now on an all-new 2015 Chevy Trax. It's a versatile, smaller SUV crossover. We just featured it here on Auto Show TV. Could be the perfect size for you. Cerrone's has a $199 a month lease on it right now, the Chevy Trax at Cerrone's. If you want something a little bigger, there's the newly restyled Jeep Cherokee. Elmwood has the 2015 Cherokee Latitude 4x4 for a lease payment of $219 a month. We love the new Cherokee. You see them everywhere. Worth taking a test drive at Elmwood Auto Group in East Providence. While checking out Elmwood, we found a great deal on another vehicle that Auto Show TV loves, and that's the new Chrysler 200. Elmwood has the 200 Limited for $149 a month. That's a low payment on a terrific mid-size sedan. Lots to choose from now at Elmwood Auto Group, Taunton Avenue in East Providence. Meantime, Maddie Imports in Fall River comes through again with some VW deals, a 2015 Volkswagen Jetta S for $149 a month. And Maddie sets that price with zero down. Maddie's VW model year-end clearance sales event going on now, $149 a month on the Jetta with automatic transmission at Maddie Imports. Maddie also has the fun to drive CC Sport with a zero down lease. Payment is just $2.79 a month. Drive away in the Volkswagen CC Sport. Comes with nav and lots more. Maddie Imports in Fall River. A lot of Rhode Islanders make the short trip to get a great deal on a VW. One of the most popular small sedans, of course, is the Honda Civic. Sakuchi in Middletown has a terrific lease deal right now. So this is the Civic EX for $99 a month. It's with a CVT transmission and lots of standard features, or you can buy it with 0.9% interest. Great deal now at Sakuchi Honda in Middletown. If you're looking at mid-size sedans, I'm sure the Malibu is on your short list. Go to Cerrone's right now for a new Chevy Malibu. Lease it for $149 a month, and that's with zero cash down and no first payment required. A new Malibu, $149 a month at Cerrone's Route 1 in South Attleboro. And again, if you're thinking mid-size sedan, the Camry is a popular choice. Colonial Toyota can put you in a new Camry SE for $199 a month with zero down. The reliability, the safety, the technology, the Camry speaks for itself. $199 a month on a 2015 Camry, now at Colonial Toyota in Smithfield. And back to Maddie Imports in Fall River, two terrific lease deals right now on brand new Audis. First, the Audi A3 1.8 T Premium Plus, no money down, 309 a month. Great deal. The A3 has nav. This one has lots more. Step up to Audi for 309 a month at Maddie Imports. Maddie can also put you in an A4 2.0 T Quattro Premium Plus for a few bucks more. For 389 a month, ride in the beautiful A4 Audi. So many standard features. And again, this lease deal has zero money down. If you have never driven an Audi, Here's a reason to go to Maddie Imports in Fall River. And that's Auto Show TV's Best Buys. Happy car shopping. Next, we travel over the bridges to Sakuchi Honda. You're watching Auto Show TV. 
For more than 25 years, people of the South Coast and beyond have trusted Toyota of Dartmouth to care for their Toyotas. With a fully enclosed drive-in and 26 dedicated service bays, your Toyota service will be quick and convenient. And this month, get our Pothole Special for just $129.95. We'll rotate and balance your tires, perform a multi-point inspection and alignment check, and a free car wash. And for your convenience, we have extended service hours and a Fall River shuttle that runs daily. Toyota of Dartmouth, South Coast's dealer of choice. You love everything about your new ride. It smells so good. But maybe you could be paying a little less for it. It's not too late, you know. Let Navigant Credit Union take a look at your rate. We could help you refinance and maybe save you a little every month. What could you do with the extra money? Hmm. Road trip, maybe? Navigant Credit Union. Enjoy life's journey. Let Elmwood Jeep make you smile. We're kicking off June with leases that start at just $2.19 a month. Choose from Wranglers, Cherokees, and Grand Cherokees, all starting at just $2.19 a month. And for a limited time, lease the 2015 Jeep Compass Latitude for just $1.85 a month. Hurry in during our drive and discover event for special pricing that is sure to put a smile on your face. Elmwood Jeep, Route 44 in East Providence or online at elmwoodcdjr.com. time you fake wearing your seatbelt, remember this. Cops have been trained to spot seatbelt violations even at night. And they don't give out fake tickets, day or night. Click it or ticket. We're back on Auto Show TV and we're here at Sakuchi Honda in Middletown and Mike Liga is joining us. You have a new member to the Honda family. Tell us all about the new HRV. We, we certainly do have a new member of the family. It's the 2016 Honda HRV. We just got it in this week. You can see it behind me here in white. Um, it's a kind of fits in a niche market there for the people that want a smaller SUV with the all-wheel drive components. And you can get this vehicle from a nice base model all the way packed full of luxury from navigation systems, moonroofs and nice touchscreen uh, technology inside the vehicle, so we're very excited about this point, John. It has a, uh, the normal front grille that you'd find on any Honda, very signature, it's a nice sure. stylish look for us, modern up to date. Inside here you'll find the 1.8 liter Dream engine from Honda, very experienced with that engine, we've had that in a very big success story in our Civic, and it's been carried over to this model. Yep. Also you can notice here on the front, it's not a lot of car in front of the front wheel there, they've lengthened out the wheelbase so that you can parallel park this very easy fit into small situations without having to do a lot of guesswork. Yeah. You also have your 17 inch alloy wheels standard on all models to give you a nice clean look there nice. and a nice comfortable ride. And then coming back you'll notice how this car kind of flows. If you notice this looks like any other car right until you get here in the B pillar and then the B pillar it starts to sweep up right until your C pillar and they've integrated this handle here in the black so that the car basically looks like a two-door. However, you can see it is a regular full door here. It is still very easy to get in and mm. out of this vehicle with plenty of headroom inside. Also on the back of the car, we've also made sure that it doesn't have a lot of rear overhang. Once again, when you're in the city and you have to do that parallel park in any tight situations, makes it very easy. Standing with this vehicle, like so many of our other Hondas, it has a rear camera also. Okay, this is a nice, nice easy lift gate there. Very easy if you know it's got the pneumatic lifts there, it comes yep. right up in very much in ease. Also, it's got a nice little hand grip there, so if you need to close it also. Plenty of height. Plenty of height, won't be banging your head there. Actually, the way it also comes over the vehicle on a rainy day when you're putting stuff in there, you almost got actual built-in protection there. Yeah, you gotta think about those pretty things. Good. <laughs> Lots of room back here, yeah. very versatile. But you got your spare tire back here. You also got some tie-down hooks to keep things secure here. Nice. And you also have, like I said, plenty of ample storage. That's with the seats up in its standard configuration. We have several different options here. One option is you can just take the bonnet of the seat up and that will lock right in place. You see that's locked in place. You have a nice flat floor here. On this flat floor you could set, maybe for example, last weekend my wife and I, we bought a fairly large plant. We were in a CRV, we put it in there, but in this vehicle here to make it very simple and easy because you have flat base and you've got nice tall space here. Also comes out very easy, you lift up the bar, seats back in place like nothing ever happened. Also, if you want the real convenience of having the full 
you've got a full flat down seat. This, this uh, folds perfectly flat here. You've got the distance all the way from the back of the driver's seat all the way to the back lift gate. And that's a fair amount of room. You can find that this side is the 60% side and you have the 40% side where you can do that on one side and lock it up. Or you can also take and put it in the full flat mode, full storage mode. The headrests move easily there. And you just put it in the full flat mode by one flip of the switch. And then you've got all this cargo space back here. Once you're done, you can flip those seats right back up and you're right back in the five, five passenger seating. Also back here, these seats are very comfortable. This front seat I have set all the way back right now. I'm five foot nine. I still have ample knee room here and I have plenty of headroom above me. I feel like looks are deceiving because there's way more room in here than I thought. When you get in here and you can see it and you see these clean lines like this, John, and the ergonomics of how this car is set up, this car is designed around people, not a car, and then the people have to figure it out. Mm. Um, you can see this clear dash here. You have a large uh, speedometer there. You have very modern, well-lit, well-displayed. Now, John, as you know, we're in our base model. It's called the HRV LX. And in this LX model, you can find here, you have your HVAC, your heating, ventilation, and air conditioning controls. Um, they are very tactile feel. If you move those and feel those buttons, they have a nice, sure, positive feel to them. Yep. And they're very nice and tight. You also have your audio system there, which your audio system has a smaller screen. In the larger models, you'll find a touch screen that's that large, and it's a seven inch touch screen, and it has many other features built into it. Also here, this would become electronic in a EX or above model. You have electronic mm -hmm. um, HVAC controls rather than those standard ones. We also have, uh, new to this segment there, the electronic parking brake. Normally you used to have people where oh, you sure. pull up the bar or you press down the big foot pedal and you know, well now this is all done electronically. You simply press it down, it parks the car, put your foot in the brake, pull up and it releases the brake. We also have a new feature here called the brake hold feature. That feature there, if you have brake hold features on and you're on a steep incline, it will make sure that the vehicle doesn't do any backing up until it goes forward. And this is a CVT automatic transmission. Yes, yes that's a CVT transmission. They find that those work very effectively. Um, I drove this car yesterday. You'll find that there's no real shift point, so it gives you good positive acceleration. And with that positive acceleration, you also find out that you're not gonna get any jerkiness of shifting from one gear to the other. Well, Mike, I've got to tell you, I think Honda knocked it out of the park with the HRV. It's beautiful. Oh, yes, they did. The really nice thing about it is you find it right here at Sakuchi Honda. And it's so funny that the car arrives with such a great car at this time. This is our, actually, this month is we celebrate our 65th anniversary. That means the Sakuchi family's been doing business on Aquidneck Island for 65 years. Our tagline here at Sakuchi Honda is the best deal made easy. So go on, check us out online, come to our uh, dealership, take one out for a drive. We'll offer you a great deal and you can get one of the first ones to be driving around the new HRV. And the only place you want to get it is at Sakuchi Honda in Middletown, Rhode Island. Well, folks, we're wrapping it up this morning on Auto Show TV. If you'd like to learn more about the deals we showed you in Best Buys or anything else about the dealerships that we feature on Auto Show TV, go to our website, theautoshow.tv. I'm John Coletto, and remember, don't drink and drive, and don't text and drive. This has been Auto Show TV, produced in cooperation with Auto Intelligence. Thanks to our participating dealers and sponsors. This has been Auto Show TV.